Hey guys, it's me Nika Brown. I'm going to show you how to do these big bouncy curls. It's how I wore my hair in the last two videos, but this time it's more fuller and more bouncier. Um, I'll show you the difference later on in the video. Before we begin, I'm going to show you the products that I used. I used a regular comb and a wide tooth comb. Um, I used a flat iron and a curling wand. This curling wand is by Con Air. It's called a U-curl. It gets up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. This is one of my favorite purchases from the last couple of months. It just gives me the curls I love. And also, it gets really hot, so it comes with love, but I never use it. I'm also going to be using this Design Essential Edge Tamer and also this Mousse by Smooth and Shine Polishing. Ultra Style, it's modifying mousse, it's lightweight and it holds my hair really well. And I'm also going to use this Olive Oil Heat Protecting Serum. The heat serum is better than like oil because it's lighter and it's protecting my hair from the heat. You can do this look on straight hair or previously curled hair, it doesn't matter which one. I'm doing my hair with this previously curled hair. If you're going to do it like me, you have to comb it out with a wide tooth comb. Um, just comb out really well. You don't want to curl on top of like tangles and uh, mess like that. If there is a God up there, I swear he cares a little more about millionaires. But why the hell you think taxes and bills are there? Where they relax and my ass has got bills to spare. Now take the heat protecting serum and place it all over your hair. You don't really need too much, but you gotta make sure to put it all over your hair because this is protecting your hair from the curling wand and the flat iron. Billionaire. Sometimes in the summer, people like. Now you're going to take your mousse and put it all over your hair as well. I use it a lot, but you really don't need so much. I'm just going to wear my hair like this for a couple of days. The more you use, the longer it lasts, but you don't need too much. Also, um, once you put it in, let your hair dry. Like, take a second uh, to let it dry and soak into your hair. I usually just play with it until it dries and then I can curl it. Once it dries, you can start curling your hair. I section off my hair and do them first. Um, I'm going away from the face and toward the face in different directions because the more you do it that way, the more um, bigger the curls will be and more um, ununified so it won't look so neat and like, polished. You just want to look kind of messy. So I do away from the face and toward the face. I, have to keep, I keep doing that over and over again in a pattern. Yeah, I'll slay a million soldiers, kill a million peasants, praise the new Jehovah, learn a million lessons. If I can't do all them things and make you proud, then I wake up, take off my makeup, and take a bow. As applause takes over the crowd, I ask God how you like me now. And he says, son, I like you a little more than I used to. Here's my daughter Jezebel, let me introduce you. Sometimes in the summer, people like to wonder. Now that I'm done curling my hair on both sides, I'm going to do um, my leave out and straighten that out. And once I finish straightening that out, I'm going to use the curling wand just to blend it in with the curly hair. So I'll be He 
said it don't matter if it don't stack fatter than the wide in his pocket. God don't be obnoxious. Falling so hard, I can't possibly stop it. At least that's what he said. I wish it was me instead. Man, I wonder if he means it. There's a world of success. Have you seen it? And if you have, can you tell me how to get there? I used to curling one to uh, lay down the flyaway hairs and also for my edges since I don't have Rolex in right now to use my edge tamer. You don't need a lot, I'm just putting on places where um, you can see my edges and you spread that out and it lays your hair down really well and sleek it down so it won't be so frizzy and makes it look neater. Then I use a wide tooth comb and just with upward motion push the hair up, you can see right here, I'm showing you, you pull the hair up, kind of teasing the hair and making your hair look fuller. And that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this look. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. Make sure you thumbs up this video. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye. She told me she weighed less than a butterfly. What if I told her I could make her feel beautiful? Is there anything you wouldn't do? If you knew everything I offered you was good for you, I bet not. I bet you got a lot of people telling you you're gorgeous. Of course you do, but I see more in you. That's the exact type of thing a nigga's forced to do. Type of thing to make a king go to war for you. Yeah, I'll slay a million soldiers, kill a million people.